75 degrees tonight, mostly clear, southeast wind 5 to 10, and we're talking about temperatures that will continue to be pretty much on the normal side, 94 degrees for tomorrow, that's valley average, heat index 106, southeast wind 10 to 15 miles an hour. Now, Futurecast shows us that for tomorrow, we'll have that familiar spread of 93 at Brownsville, 95 at Roma, Heat index 104, 105, 106, and along the coast, temperatures in the mid to upper 80s. Now, for a Thursday afternoon, much the same, but you're going to see something strange here. 85 for Harlingen. Why? Because Futurecast is picking up on the potential for a shower at that hour, right before, a click or two before this, it's like 94, 95. So, again, we're expecting a chance for a shower to come back into the forecast, into play by Thursday afternoon. Conditions for the bay tomorrow, well, pretty nice, moderate chop, and we're looking at surf about one to two feet, so if you've got an itching to get out there, get out there and have a good time. Don't forget, mosquitoes carry heartworm, so if you're out walking the dog like I was, make sure your dog is up to speed on his or her monthly heartworm treatment. That's important. That stuff works like, um, like magic. You just don't miss. I think you have like a two-week grace period with the medication. Otherwise, you know, you could be in big trouble. Uh, heartworm is fatal. Uh, now, we're looking at Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, the mosquitoes backing off. Well, a couple of reasons here. The first wave of males should be dying off. They only live five to seven days, something like that. As well, the overall spraying by city and county folks should be putting a dent in the population as well. Not putting a dent in temperatures, really. We're just going to stick with normal 94 to 96 degrees between now and early next week. The heat index is going to be up there 105, 106, 107 each day. Remember, your body cools by sweat evaporating off your skin. That's why we give you the heat index number, because that's what your body thinks it is. It may be 95, but it feels like 105. Now, there's that opportunity for rain. The daily dose starting Thursday. We saw that with the temperature reading for Thursday afternoon for Harlingen on Futurecast. There's Saturday, 40% chance for showers. Hmm, a little boost. I'll show you why. And then the daily dose coming back into play. All right, here's why. Upper level low pressure is going to come across because you can see the winds don't quite, don't quite match up with what's going on with the low because the winds are at the surface and this is way up in the atmosphere. So this is going to come on in for Friday afternoon and help to kick up a couple of showers there. 20% chance, that's it. And then it continues to slowly roll its way on toward us. And you can see, again, enhancing our opportunity Saturday on through the afternoon. That's your 40% bullseye for Saturday afternoon. Nothing spectacular at all. But every shower counts now because every drop is runoff. 94, 95, Saturday and Sunday, 40% chance for showers translates to a 20% chance. And the tropical update, well, you know what's going on out there. East AES is going to continue moving on up New York State north. Again, the folks in Vermont not liking that, remembering Irene of years ago. But good news is high pressure is going to keep everything uh, on the clear and calm heading on into the, uh, well, at least next several days. The seven-day forecast runs you through with that chance for showers increasing on Saturday and then back to the daily dose as we move into next week.